Hi, George here, and I'll be showing you how to make a custom title menu screen here for Minecraft. This is Minecraft Java. Let's just quickly get back to the title screen. I'll hit the escape key and save and quit to title. Here we go. Here is the regular one right now. And let's change this over to my new custom one. Go down to options. And I have it set up as a resource pack. And it's right there. Just load that resource pack in. Now these are all red because they just changed the pack format number in pack MC Meta. I'll have to change all of those, get those updated again. I'll do that for a different video. Choose done. Let this load in. Choose done again. And there's my new custom background. I see there are two things about this. It's my own picture. And also it's not a scrolling panorama any longer. It's just that. In a different video, I'll show you how you can recolor or change the title up here. And also how you can put color onto the buttons as well. It's all easy to do but I'll do those each as a separate video. Okay, let's see how I did this. The first thing we need to do is to get out of Minecraft. Let's just quit that game. And get back here to the Minecraft launcher. There we go again, I'm playing in Java right now. Now we need to get the vanilla or standard resource pack out of the game. Let me show you where that is right now. This is 120.4. The same trick applies to most versions of Minecraft. So. The only reason that the version matters here is so you get the right number inside of pack MC Meta. And I'll talk about that in just a bit. But first, let's go over here to installations. And you want to go into latest release. And over here it says play. Just to the right, there's a little folder icon. Click on that folder icon. That opens up the Minecraft folder in here. And then come down to versions. It's right there. Open that up. And in here, find your current version. Again, we're in 124, so I'll just scroll down for that. Now ignore all of this stuff. Ignore anything that has a pre on or anything like that. You want the one that just says the version that you're in. 124, that's our current version right here. Open this up, and you should see a jar and a JSON file in here. If you only see one file, that's because you haven't played this version yet. So if you're only seeing just the JSON file, or you're seeing just that one file, make sure you run the game, at least as far as the title screen, and then close it down again. That's because right before the title screen loads, that's when the jar file is downloaded. So you have to run it to get that jar file. Now, if you're not seeing the .json or the .jar after it, these are the file name extensions. Go up here to view, come down to show, and check file name extensions right here. This is again Windows 11. If you're on Windows 10, go up to the top, click on the view tab, and then click on file name extensions, put a check mark next to that. And you'll then see those extensions. Okay, let's go ahead. We're going to be copying this out. I'll bring up another drive window in here so we can copy this. Here we go. And I have a folder that I made on my hard drive. I just named it pack. It's just do a new folder, call it whatever you want. I called it pack, nothing special about that. And that's just a place for me to work on my resource packs. And I also have a new file here. This is just an image. I did this over in Photoshop. You can do it any graphics program you want. It doesn't matter, just a flat image. And the size on this is 1280 by 720, and it's a PNG file. And that's all you need, just something to put in the background. You can use a photograph, you know, anything you want. I just made my own graphic for that. And then take the jar file over here, and I'm going to right drag this and copy over there. Don't move it, make sure you're just copying that jar file. Okay, we're done with this for right now. Now we need to get into this, get the files that we need to build our new resource pack. So for that, click into the name, Click it once, click it a second time, and you should be able to type in here, then just backspace over the jar and make that say zip instead. Click outside, get this warning, just choose okay. So it now converts that to a zip file. Actually, it always was a zip file, it just had a different name on it. We can now open this thing up. Right click, and I'll open this up in a new window. Just makes it easier. Here we go, here's our new window. Now you're also going to need a pack PNG file and you'll find that right in here. You can make your own if you want to, or you can use the regular one. We'll just come down. It's pretty far down on the list in here. Just find where the P's are sitting. Right there, pack PNG. Right drag it over here and choose copy. And that's just that grass block image right there. Okay, back in here again. Scroll back to the top. And then go inside of assets, inside of Minecraft. Come down here and go inside of textures right here. And then go inside of GUI. And then inside of title, there we go. And in here, go inside of background. And you want that file right there, panorama overlay.png. Same thing, I'm just going to right drag it over here and we'll copy that. 
Okay, that's our little thing. We're gonna be replacing this with this. Now, we need to make our folders in here for our resource pack, and that's this stuff up here. Assets, Minecraft, Textures, GUI, Title, and Background. That's what we went into to find that file. I'm gonna just change the view here to a little bit smaller and make this large icons. There we go. And we'll go up to New, Folder. The first one is Assets. So inside of Assets, same thing, New Folder. This one is Minecraft. So inside of that folder, New Folder. This next one is Textures. There we go. Inside of this one, New Folder, GUI. Inside of that one, New Folder, Title. Inside of Title, New Folder, and Background. There we go. Inside of here is where our other file goes. So we'll go ahead and we'll do that. We're now done with this zip file. You can close that out of the way. Let's go back here to the basic folder. That's my pack folder. And this file goes inside of there and it gets named this. We'll do that as a separate pass on this. I'm just gonna drag and drop or you can right click and copy if you want to. Let's, we'll do it that way. Right click and let's copy. Right here, I'm in Windows 11. So if you're in Windows 10, you may just see the word copy in there. Let's go all the way inside and right click and we'll paste that in right here. There we go. Let's go back out again and come over here and click in once, click in a second time. That gets the name selected, right click and copy the name and then back inside again. There we go, all the way in. And then click in once, click a second time, right click and paste. And that's now renamed the right name. Okay, so that's all that has to do. Back out to pack again. So we have our images all taken care of in here. We have our pack PNG taken care of in here. We need one more thing in here and that's a pack MC meta file and that kind of runs everything. So I had to have that file. Minecraft doesn't include that file in their vanilla resource pack. So I just put it up on my website. Let's go ahead and switch over to that. I'll bring that site up. Here we go. And I'll put this link in the description so you can just click on that and get right to this page. And then right down here, I have all the different pack MC meta files in here. They're all inside of zip files going clear back to 161. We want the top one here, the 123 to 124. Right now it's pack format 22. So just, so just download this, click on that. There's our download button. And I'll save it back to my same pack folder. So it's in the same location, choose save. There we go, we can close this down now. And here's a zip file. Now right click on this. Let's open this up in a new window, which is right here. And then take this file and just drag it over here. That's the one you want. Get rid of this. And that's all set to go. If you're using Minecraft 123 or 124, this is all set. And if you're using something else, you can edit that. I always like to edit mine inside of Notepad++. Let me bring that up. It's a great little editor. And that's just the number right here, the pack format number. Right now it's at 22. This changes all the time. It keeps on getting higher. It jumps by several numbers on each new version coming out. So the next new version comes out, that may change again. If you want to give your pack a name, you can do it right here. This just shows up in the list of packs inside of the game. So up to you if you want to do that or not. I'll just leave mine saying custom pack. That's fine. This is correct for the current version of Minecraft. And we're all set to build a resource pack. That's all we actually need. Now over here on the pack PNG, if you want to use a different picture, it's okay. This is just a 128 by 128 PNG file. Any picture you want, doesn't matter. Just put it at that size and a PNG and you're all set. I'll do that at that pack PNG. Now we need the assets, hold the control key down, we need that pack PNG and we need that pack MC meta. Everything else we don't need, it's all taken care of. Right click and then compress to zip file. And I'll just put in here 1.20.4 title screen. Okay, that's all set to go. We now need to get this into the game. And for that, we'll go back over here to the Minecraft launcher. We're still in installations. And let's go back here to that folder icon right there and come down here to resource packs. There it is right here. Go inside of that and you put it right here. And let's take this, I'm just gonna drag and drop like that. There it is inside, we're all set to go. These are the packs that I have to fix the pack PNG number. Those are the ones that are showing up red right now. I'll go back and I'll do that at some point. I'll put that in a different video. That's all set to go. Close that down. Let's close this down. Now we need to launch the game and then activate that resource pack. So go here to play, launch the game to the title screen. Here's Minecraft, come down into options and then resource packs and look for your new pack right here. Here it is, custom pack. There's the name of the pack right there. 
Let's bring that over. It's loaded in. Choose done. And then done one more time. It's going to load that pack in. And there we go. There's that new screen. I haven't changed the color up here for a Minecraft yet on this one. And I haven't changed the button colors, any of those things. But there's a new background picture. So we've stopped that panorama and put in a new background picture. In the next few videos, I'll show you how to recolor or change the title up here. Also, how to change the button colors right in here. Make those look a lot nicer. If you like this video, hit that like button, click on share, click on subscribe, of course. I'm still about 25,000 subscribers away from hitting that magical 100,000 subscriber number, which I'm really trying to get. So make sure you just hit that subscribe button and help me out there. And I'll see you next time with some more great customizing videos.